All right, what's going on guys? Try back again, here to bring you another video. This one's gonna be doing another quick little review of a teaser trailer from San Diego Comic-Con 2014. This one coming from Skybound, link will be in the description, and that is for Robert Kirkman's featuring Norman Reedus, who is, of course, Daryl from The Walking Dead. This one is called Air. All right, sweet. So yes, this one's going to be a movie and it does not have a release date yet, but we got to see the teaser. So check out that teaser in the description. Let me know what you guys think about it. It's pretty quick. It's not long anyway, but um, it does kind of give us an idea of the visual style of the movie and sort of the premise of the movie. Now, I had heard about a bit about this one, but I really didn't know what to think about it because it, I mean, it's, it's kind of one of those, there's no comic book series based on it. There's no previous, it, it, you know, it's not associated with a book that I know of or anything in terms of other literature, comic books, whatever. So it's something entirely new for the movie. Um, it says, Air Wake Cycle, this is the synopsis from IMDb, is about two custodians who struggle to hold on to their sanity, living in an underground bunker with cryogenically frozen people meant to repopulate society and from the um, counter there's a counter above them when they open up the airlock they can see all the air gets sucked out in the counter and just starts cycling down very very quickly now I believe that's a, a day counter I think for the amount of days they have left to survive and um, it's in a post-apocalyptic world in some way shape or form we don't know if it's been caused by war or who knows what, but it, it will be featuring Norman Reedus and the other custodian, because there's the two it says in the synopsis, is uh, Digimon Ho Han Su. So it, it, if you watch it, you'll know the guy's face. He's been in like a bazillion things. He's all over the place, tons of movies, tons of TV shows, stuff like that. He's been in all kinds of stuff. So it does sound really cool. Now, aside from that, We've got a reporter, we've got an anchorman, we've got Sleeper One, and that's it in terms of the credited cast for the uh, movie itself. So, I mean, there's not a lot of other details out there for me to really speculate on. Um, in terms of the teaser itself and what I think about uh, the movie, it sounds cool. It looks like it's going to be kind of a character uh, concentration on the two, of course, with the movie, so insanity. So it's kind of one of those things that Kirkman does really well with The Walking Dead, for example, and Norman Reedus as well with his character Daryl um, and that character development. So it looks like it's going to be a really interesting character, sci-fi, thriller, post-apocalyptic type of, uh, of movie. And uh, I like it. I think it looks cool. I'm interested. I'm interested to see, you know, what this is going to end up like. Now, once we get the official full-length trailer that's not just like a teaser and we get more details about the movie, we find out a release date, whether or not it's going to be coming out in 2014 or if it's going to be 2015. I think it'd be 2015 at some point. But uh, I am definitely interested to check it out because, of course, I'm a big fan of Norman Reedus. plays Daryl, big fan of Kirkman. It's one of his uh, types of uh, movies, one of his things. The guy, that guy is so busy. It's crazy. He's got all kinds of stuff coming out. The Walking Dead, the spinoff Walking Dead, the comic book series for The Walking Dead, Invincible, and all the other stuff he's doing, these side things, is, is really crazy. He's got kind of got his uh, hands in. So um, aside from that, uh, just to mention about the teaser, I really like the music. Now, some people in the comments are saying they hate the music or they think it's weird. To me, it sounds like 80s, like zombie movie music with a sci-fi kind of updated uh, new nuance twist to it. So it, it really sounds... It really cool to me. It's kind of got that like it's kind of like freaky synthesized futuristic synthesized type music, and uh, this is one that I'm I'm pretty excited for. I'm I'm kind of in that in that sort of let let's let's watch let's wait let's see what more we get to see before the actual release of the movie. I don't want to say I want to get like super excited for it at this point yet because we don't have enough yet to see. But I'm intrigued is what I am. I'm very intrigued to see what they're doing with this. And I don't think Kirkman or Norman Reedus would really take time out of their schedule to do this if they didn't have a really great story, right? If they didn't have like an amazing story. And it's really weird to see Norman Reedus in a different role like this. It's like, oh, it's Daryl, but it's not, you know? And uh, where are you going to go? You ain't got no air. <laughs> I don't know. I, I don't know. I mean, it's just, uh, it, it's a weird one, but um, 
I'm intrigued for sure. So let me know what you guys think about AIR. Uh, if you have any more details on it, please feel free to share them in the comments below. That's all I could really find after searching for like 20 minutes for it on, on the web. And um, put all the links in the description so you guys can read about it, can watch the trailer and everything like that. I'm very excited for it. You know, I, I, I want to see, I'm very excited to see more of what this movie is going to be and what it's got to offer because it's got the people involved that I know, obviously, with what they've done with Walking Dead, um, have a lot of skills and are great at a, you know, post-apocalypse genre. So we'll see what this one's all about. So it sounds, it sounds interesting. So let me know what you guys think about all that. If you liked my quick little uh, teaser trailer review, please like it below, thumb it up. And if you want to help support the channel, please share it, favorite it, guys. And uh, yeah, that's it for this video. See you guys for the next one. It's Trev, saying peace.